morning guys and a welcome to this travel vlog right now we are still at home but our suitcases are packed to go to turkey we are still waiting for our taxi and by taxi i mean danny's dad because he is going to drive us to schiphol amsterdam and we are flying at three three o'clock three o'clock <laughs> <laughs> so we still have to wait a little bit longer but we are going to take you along with us on our eight day holiday not sure how many parts i am going to create out of this but i'm going to try to film as much as possible so if you are excited about all the holiday summer beach pool cocktail vibes don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already click the little notification bell so you will be updated on all the new videos and vlogs i post on this channel and while you're at it also give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching these holiday vlogs and without further ado let the holiday begin <laughs> in our hotel room the lightning is uh, pretty scary from here but we made it we are tired it is now like half past ten we have our room you're not tired I just want the party. this is the room not sure how well you can see it but I will probably give you a room tour it's Danny's birthday tomorrow and they gave us fruit a little cake I guess and what is the other stuff I'm not sure is it wine, wine. what is it red wine. dry red wine not a big fan but it's okay but we are here we are probably going to explore a little bit and after that we are going to sleep and tomorrow the fun and games will start so yeah, for now we are just going to settle in a bit. I think I'm quick, quickly going to show you the room because right now it is still neat and within a day it is going to be a disaster. So yeah, quick view of the room and after that we are just going to explore and unwind. So I am standing with my back against the door. Right here we have some storage which is still empty because we need to get our clothes in here. There is a little safe. On the left side we have the bathroom which I have not seen myself. You have a separate toilet with a closing glass door. A mirror with towels some glasses not really sure what this is a lot of soapies and we also have a little bathtub 
I wanted to say where is the shower head, but it's over there. You can also hang it over there. And these are also some sliding doors for the water to not spill. On the left, we have our suitcases. Another big mirror. A very big bed and a small bed. Some space for luggage. Another big as mirror. Right here, there is a little mini bar, and this is just this comes with the all inclusive, so we can just grab this, and this is going to be refilled every morning the guy just said to us so there is some beer some cola iced tea water and some peach and cherry nectar all right we have another big bottle of water right there and some tea and coffee it's very spacious treats for Danny's birthday and the balcony with Danny little seething area well there is a lot of noise going on but big party. this is our view if we look to the left you see the big pool right here and there is a party going on over there which is probably like the other hotel and right here it's the massive resort So we are probably going to eat Denny's cake and I think we are going to walk around the hotel a little bit. I think he wants something to drink. But the view is so pretty! So we will see you tomorrow morning, probably at breakfast. At my birthday. It's his birthday tomorrow, so we are gonna have a celebration. It's all my birthday. <laughs> I will do what I want. I will do what I want. Okay, bye. Good morning on day two, which is officially our first full day here at the resort. We just had breakfast downstairs and they have a massive breakfast buffet, so I'm not even sure if I have seen everything, but we had breakfast and right now we are going to get ready to head over to the pool, which can be seen a little bit, maybe, maybe not. I will show you in a sec, but I'm gonna lather up in sunscreen and then I'm going to put on my bikini and we are headed to the pool and throughout the day I will try to do some um, some little catch up with you guys and there is also a slight chance that there is going to be a difference between filming quality because right now i am filming on a, a little insta360 camera and i am also filming some stuff on my phone so if you are seeing a little bit of difference between the quality then that is the case behind the camera birthday boy is peeking through the window because it's daddy's birthday It's his birthday! 34 year old. Happy birthday, awesome. big boy! Yeah. Yeah. So right now my leg is getting squashed. <laughs> no, we are going to get ready for the pool. And I'm going to talk to you throughout the day. I do not know when, but you will see me. But yeah, that is our status update right now. And we are going to dip in the pool. Bye!
a quick little update we have spent the entire day at the pool and we were even treated with a little pool party in the afternoon with some foam and music and like blow up sharks and like all kinds of fun stuff so yeah we had a lot of fun hanging around at the pool not really sure how well the camera is picking it up but i am a little sunburned but oh well what do you expect with a redhead in turkey right now we are finishing getting ready for dinner and yeah it's like half past six so normally we are extremely early with dinner but now we have to wait for half past six before the dinner buffet opens up so we are going to head out to get ourselves some food behind me you can see the view which is not bad so yeah that is the little update up until now hopefully i can film something for you this evening but i'm not sure how well the cameras are going to handle the darkness because right here in turkey it's getting dark pretty darn soon so i hope that i can film some stuff for you guys but first we need to grab ourselves something to eat Hello again. We are done with dinner. And okay. now we are uh, bellying out, as uh, Danny would say. Out bellying. <laughs> out bellying. <laughs> like we out are bellying. letting our food digest. So we are going to do a quick uh, rest or a quick nap or whatever you may call it. If I back, if I out belly. If I belly. So uh, this is the current state. And uh, after that, we are probably going downstairs because there is a bar with some live music. And I think that that is basically the plan for tonight. Right? Yes, I but hear. first, outbellion. Outbellion. We are walking back to the room. Danny is having fun doing a little dancey dance. But we had a little party. But we have to pee. And what better way to pee than at your own hotel room? Oh, it's 11 o'clock and it's 26 degrees here. Oh. That was the weather forecast from Danny Vendekol. It's very hot. Hot, hot, Too hot, hot to dance. Too hot, 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 hot for clothes. <laughs> okay. Okay, bye. Good morning on day three of our turkey holiday vlog. We just had some dinner downstairs and I managed to film a little bit on my phone. Not really sure how well that is turning out, but you have a slight peek at how the breakfast buffet is looking. Along the walls you basically had all the warm dishes. So potatoes, sausages, eggs, uh, Turkish pastries, like all the warm, more of the unhealthy kind of stuff, if you know what I mean. And yeah, I see that you cannot really see it that well, but along these walls you can get all the warm stuff. And moreover, to the left, in the middle of the room, you also could get some normal bread options, some cereal options, and like a lot more of the cold 
basic breakfast kind of items as you can see right here some normal pastries with egg with sausages and you could also opt it out for a lot of fresh fruits And this was basically my breakfast every day. Here you see Danny eating and he is aggressively pointing to a cat. Hello. I already missed my cats by day three, so I was happy to see one. <laughs> uh, we also immediately booked a uh, Turkish massage and we can actually go there in like 30 minutes so we are going to spend a little time in our hotel room to just pass the time and wait for 30 minutes and after that we are getting a Turkish bath and an Aura candle massage I'm not really sure what that is but I have high hopes of very large relaxation vibes so i am very curious to find out how i'm going to like that so we are going to do that together and after the massage we are probably going to head over to the pool and just chill in the sun and in the pool i must say that i have to watch myself a little bit in the sun because day one resulted in a little sunburn even though i like lathered up in sunscreen all the time but hey that's the life of being a redhead so yeah that was our quick little update for today day three and i will probably catch you up after the massage to tell you a little bit what happened and also if we liked it or if we think we just wasted a bunch of money so on to the massage So we are back from the one and a half hour massage. <laughs> My hair is a little wet. We started off with 30 minutes, minutes, 30 minutes of a Turkish hammam. There is someone screaming in the background. Let's go inside because uh, otherwise you cannot hear me. And now it's dark. That is a little better. So we started off with 30 minutes of Turkish hammam and we basically got a scrub and we got cleaned from the inside and out. She even washed my hair. And after that we both had an hour long um, massage. And for me it felt like a Thai massage, but I'm not really sure if that was the case, but it felt like that. And I thought it was very nice. It was very relaxing. <laughs> it was very relaxed. It was his first massage. First massage ever. First massage ever. Yeah. Do you think you are going to do a massage ever again or was it a once no. a one time thing? I think uh, I will do it again. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Maybe you have to go to the same Thai massage that I go to in Holland. Maybe. Okay. So did that ticked off the box and right now we are going to get ready to head over to the pool.
another good morning from this yellow balcony welcome to day four of our trip every time i forget how many days we've been here but it's day four so time is flying by very quickly we had breakfast as usual and right now we are going to get ready to the pool and i suggest that you put on your bathing suit as well because I have the dive case right here, so you guys are going to come into the water with us. So much fun! So I'm going to put this camera in this diving case, hopefully it will go very smoothly because I have not used this before, but yeah, that is what we are going to do today. We are going to swim together. There is a lot going on in terms of birds over there, <laughs> but okay. That is basically it. So in a minute, you will probably dive in the pool with us. Goodbye.
But we are back in the hotel room after we have watched some kind of African circus vibe act. I filmed some stuff for you guys and you have probably already seen it by now, I guess. They were very bendy. What? They were very bendy. They were very bendy. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking... I didn't see a band. <laughs> what did you mean by that? But the crowd was very tough because I had to clap my hands like all red and scream my lungs out because the entire fucking crowd was like crickets. I don't understand because these guys were like doing their absolute best and they were pretty amazing. So... Tough crowd, but very cool act. After that, we did some drinks, well, some one drink at the pool bar. And right now, we are crashing the hotel room. And tomorrow, we are going to do it all over again. But then we have some kind of Tutang Amon. I'm not really sure how you say that in Tutang English. Tutang Amon. How do you say it in English? Tutang Amon. I don't know. It's Some a famous kind of people. Uh, it's a famous. It's person. a famous people. <laughs> oh, it's a far out from Egypt. It's a famous people. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what it is, but I don't know how to pronounce it in English. Total guy, man. Anyway, we are going to have a very cool party at the pier. We have not even been to the beach yet because we both don't really like sand. But there is a beach and there is also a pier and the party tomorrow is going to be on the pier. So I'm going to try and film a little bit of that. But first we are going to sleep and tomorrow we are going to do breakfast, pool and party. So I'm not complaining. So yeah, sleep tight and we will see you tomorrow. <laughs> 